Hey, what's up everyone? This is Todd Hazleton with Techno Buffalo. This morning I just installed Windows Phone 8.1 Developer Preview. It's the latest release from Microsoft. And I wanted to walk you through Cortana and the digital assistant that Microsoft hopes is going to compete with Siri and Google Now and other uh, competitors on the market. So let's take a look at how it works. All right, so you get started by just tapping Cortana, the icon up there, or by hitting the search button, although that's a little different, but I'll show you Cortana first. Tap that, open it up. Here she says top stories for the day. So I have it set up to show me headlines and business news, the weather where I am, which is Jersey City here, the final score for the Nets, and the Yankees. Um, and you can change however you want those sports teams in your interests. Uh, so the daily glance, you can see here I have weather, commute, and headlines. Traffic I haven't set up because I'm not usually driving that often here. Headlines, like I said, eat and drink. It'll show me uh, nearby places as I'm walking around, hopefully. And then Jets, Nets, and Yankees are the, the uh, sports teams that I follow. Trip planner and the weather near me. So you can also add anything you want if you want to add, say, different sports. Click that, search for a team, say you're a Mets fan, and you could add the Mets. So that's how you customize uh, Cortana here. And there's other options here, Remind Me, Quiet Hours, your inner circle. So those, those are going to be the people that you're allowed to uh, contact the most. You saw some Hazeltons in there, obviously my wife and my brother. Uh, music searches. So if you use Cortana to pick up the music that's playing somewhere, that'll all come in here in your history. So let's, uh, let's see how it works, because that's what you care about most, right? So we hit the speaker button here. And what's the weather in New York? So really quick there, and you bring up uh, it brings up the weather for you. So let's say, uh, uh, give me directions to Philadelphia. Okay, getting you directions to Philadelphia. Well, so it looks like it crashed. And, and keep in mind, this is a beta. Uh, directions to Pennsylvania. Sure thing. Getting you directions to Pennsylvania. Okay, so it looks like that's not working properly right now. I could say other things though. Remind me to call John. When should I remind you? Uh, six o'clock. Sure. I'll remind you to call John at 6 p.m. today. Is that right? Yes. Great. So that's already added into my calendar now to call John at 6 o'clock, which is pretty nice. Uh, we can go through and do other things too. It's kind of funny. I could say, um, who's your daddy? Oh, it picked up everything there. Who's your daddy? Technically speaking, that'd be Bill Gates. No big deal. All right. So there's a couple Easter eggs sitting inside Windows Phone 8.1 and Cortana, which is fun too. Now let me show you real quick the other search. So if you hold down that. It brings up Cortana, and you can also speak it right here. Add surfing to my calendar for Saturday. What time does it kick off? At 10 a.m. What should I call it? Surfing. Sure. Add Irving to your calendar for Saturday at 10 a.m. All right, so it didn't get surfing. It said Irving. But you can see that you can also access it right from that search key, too, as, as opposed to hitting the icon. And uh, there's a bunch to talk about in Windows Phone 8.1. We've got, you can see the new home screen where the backgrounds kind of uh, see through there. Uh, the lock screen is not part of this. The customizable lock screen theme is not part of the Windows Phone 8.1 developer preview. Uh, but hopefully we'll see that soon. And actually, real quick, you can see Cortana was bringing up headlines, too, on the live tile on the home screen. So hopefully we've uh, covered up a lot of what Cortana offers and uh, there's a bunch more. It can go through your emails and show you updates on your packages, your travel plans and stuff like that. But again, we've only been playing with it uh, for a little bit this morning. We're going to try to bring you some comparisons with uh, Siri and Google Now. In any case, that's a quick look at Cortana. This is Todd Hazelton for Techno Buffalo. What's up, everyone? Thank you for watching that video. If you want to see more of the latest and greatest tech news, you can subscribe to our main Techno Buffalo channel by clicking the button right down below in my pants region, or click on the buttons to your right to see more videos.